What's going on everybody out there? Brooklyn Boys here. And since you can't see us, it's me and Mike. Yo. And we are doing, as you can see since the camera is pointed this way, we're doing a special unboxing of the Call of Duty Black Ops 4 Pro Edition only available at GameStop opening thing. Yeah. So basically, if you didn't want to spend the $200 on the collector's edition that came with a really cool box, a puzzle and whatnot, this is your next best bet because with this, you get not only a physical copy of the game with the um, season pass and whatnot, if you're like me and you don't like digital games and you like still having physical games, uh, not only that, but you can still get the steel book and a couple of the, it doesn't show, oh yeah, it does, it shows a little bit here, and you get a couple of the extras that came with the collector's edition. And of course, it shows you everything here, so um, we're going to go with back to front, and now one thing I do want to say is obviously I took the plastic off of this already. See? Makes life easier. We just reach from the top and pull out. Now, I did open the case, and I've already installed the Black Ops Pass. This is basically the season pass for the year. It comes with day one classified zombie experience. Experience. Um, it comes with the full year's worth and then you get this which is some fun digital content you get a couple of outfits you get the signature weapon you get a cool um, calling card you get some money in game and then also from stop and uh, from stop and shop <laughs> from GameStop you also got an exclusive gun which I don't have picture of here so um all right, let's reach in and see what we got first. Black Ops 4. And in here, if I'm correct, yes, I am. This is the pop socket. Oh. Let's just, do you take that, please? Let's move it on the side. So, uh, you put it on your phone, basically, as you can see. And you can carry your phone around with it. Can we open this? Probably not, because they probably didn't make it a Ziploc. No, they, right but there. I can reach off screen right here. See That's trusty right. trusty scissor. My trusty scissor that you didn't even see do that because it was so fast. And we're just going to slide it out. Okay. Eh. So there's your pop socket. Call of Duty Black Ops. Looks really, really nice. Has a really good... Oh, okay. So you take the sticky off and then it sticks on. Yeah, we're, we're not doing that to our cell phones. Maybe if we... Maybe the case I would do it to... I don't know. But I don't need a pop socket, so I'm just going to keep it the way it is. Put that there. All right. Next item. Again, Black Ops. Again, the same logo that we have for the pop socket. Cool. And we open this up. And this is going to be cool. We got to do it slowly, though. And with this, we get... Oh, some patches. A lot of patches. Every single divisions, or every single classes... I can't even get it all in frame. Could you move the... Just hold the game there. Let's see if I back it up. Hard. Yes! Every single special ops... Um, are, what are they called? Let's read this again. They are the specialists. Yeah, I was right. Special so Specialist classes, patches. Yeah, special. So we got the fire break, uh, fire break... Torque, Profit, Battery, Nomad, Ajax, Ruin, Crash, Surf, and Recon. I love them all. They all look awesome. And they're all patches. So you can actually take them off of here. Uh, they're just put on by the ever so gentlest scotch, you know, uh, two-way tape. And yeah, you can... Uh, on all patches? Yes. So you can put them on your jacket. Or like me, I would probably frame them. Knowing me, I'd probably frame them. All right. Oh, now it's a zombie. So we had the picture. We had the four. Now we have the Call of Duty Black Ops 4 with the word zombie. And it's cool for the month of October. Oh, yeah. And here, oh, these are made of nice stock. These are some. Oh, wow. These are some zombie cards, and it is from uh, Black Ops Zombies. This one is from, as you can see here, Voyage of Despair, which is actually the zombies on the Titanic. This one is from the Gladiator Stadium. And I'm guessing the last one is going to be Blood of the Dead, the prison with the original yeah, zombie good. crew back. It is, and I have no idea where to put it because We're the patches. Right you know what? We're going to close the patches a little bit. We're going to... 
I'm just gonna close the patches. the patches. Yeah, I'm sorry guys, but you saw the patches for a, a good while now, so. And now, of course, all that's left. Whoop. Without. Without knocking the camera down, see nothing left. Nice, nice box. It's very, very good job. Good job. By the way, I do want to say that if you get the Pro Edition from GameStop, a dollar uh, of the um, proceeds go to the Call of Duty. I forget what the organization is called. Oh, here we go. Call of Duty Endowment. That's right here. Oh. A dollar of every Pro Edition purchase will be donated to the Call of Duty Endowment. That's a good cause. And so here's the steel book. The only other way you can get the steel book, unless you want to pay the $200. And it looks... Oh, there's a zombie one. And then we open it up. And obviously I took the papers out already. Uh, let's remove the so game. So you get the full uh, back cover of the game. Yeah. Which is all this side. Oh, no. Wait, let me just... Let me uh, do that. Yeah, looks so. gorgeous and then just black disc black ops 3 4 now we're recording this on sunday so this should be going up on monday um expect gameplay uh anywhere from today if you're watching this monday uh to uh, well tuesday we're gonna have frontline live so uh wednesday maybe maybe wednesday maybe thursday it all depends on oh no thursday i'm busy so either wednesday mon uh, monday or we'll see but really 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 awesome love this this is a really cool addition and then if let's say you want to put everything back you can we're not we're probably going to put this with our other games i do love it it looks great i'm very excited to get back into some black ops now the only downside to black ops is and you all know this because uh, you all know I like me some uh, single player campaign and the one thing I'm very kind of let down about is the fact that there is no there's there's no campaign this time around and I'm sad I, I wanted a campaign I'm sorry I'm just gonna play with the pop socket there we go so you pull it out like that and, and it if it's right stuck to your phone. phone yeah I did that so I could maybe have it stand up there we go paper so um that's the only downside is there's no single campaign however there are special lips special lips there's special lips in here her lips no uh there are specialist um modes where you can go through and learn how to use each specialist and inside those modes there is an actual movie so this what a lot of people are speculating is that um that was going to be what the single player campaign was about I was going to take place before Black Ops 3, but after Black Ops 2. I don't know. If that makes any sense. It didn't happen. So, in the end, uh, we got a specialist spotlight-ish campaign with zombies. And, of course, they're not doing their... Also, the reason why I want to make sure I got this, especially this time around, which a lot of people are picketing against Black Ops because of this. A lot of people are just making sure they do this. Uh, personally, I mean, I wish I had World War II in here to show you guys, but I always make sure to get the steel book with the season pass when it comes to Call of Duty. So this sounds more like an uh, apocalypse they're fighting against rather than just a regular war game. It is. It's not World War II. They went kind of back to the way they were, but before they went all futuristic, wall-running, ridiculous, jetpack, nutsoid, you know, advanced warfare. All right. So, um... The one thing, uh, a lot of people are against it because it's kind of forcing you. If you don't get the Black Ops Pass with the game at launch, right now there's no way to get this on its own. And they're claiming it'll be available. Like I looked it up and they say that the pass is going to be available soon. I think the reason they're not releasing the pass day one is because, well, if you look at the pass right here, it says with day one bonus of a classified fourth zombie map. That's why probably the season pass was not released on the same day as the game. They want people to feel like, hey, you've got something exclusive for buying the game with the season pass day one. But, uh, like other people, I kind of do agree. Uh, if I didn't find this Pro Edition at GameStop, uh, I wasn't going to pay $200 for you know the Collector's Edition. I would have ended up getting the regular version and... Whenever the season pass came out is when I would have grabbed it. But they're not doing the season pass the way they always do. This time around, they're going to be doing little updates here, there, and everywhere. Kind of like what they did with World War II, but not. 
uh, there, there's battle, there's a battle royale mode here now, and that's what takes over the single player campaign. So you have multiplayer, zombies, and battle royale. I'm very excited to get into battle royale. Maybe we'll get Michael to play some battle royale on PlayStation. I will be streaming this on Twitch. Um, just because it's multiplayer doesn't mean uh, there's no fun to be had. I have a couple of friends that are getting this game, and hopefully more as time moves on. But that's that. What do you think? I think that, you know, I mean, with... Uh the stuff that it came with looks really nice. Like, I like the artwork it came with. And the game itself, like, it's getting... Call of Duty games, they get, like, the really big hypes. Like, I see tons of people who look forward to every new Call of Duty game that comes out. Including Black Ops 4. I'm sure a lot of people will be buying this and playing this on the... Uh, they are. On the uh, PlayStation... Came out on Friday. Yeah, so I'll, I'm sure a lot of people will be playing this on the uh, Game Pass... Along with no, no, the, no. The Game Pass is. Uh, I mean, Xbox. I mean, not the Game Pass. The um, I'm thinking system. Of Xbox. Yeah, the system. Yeah, and uh, the patches are really nice as well. So, um, if you're someone who likes to collect some army stuff, or if you like some zombie games like we've had in the past uh, years, like Resident Evil or something mm -hmm. that involves zombies, and since it is the month of October, I mean, it is Halloween around the corner. Then yeah, pro see pro edition is the right thing for you, or the right type of season. Yep. And going up with this, as a matter of fact, I, I'll make sure that this goes up first. I surprised Michael today. We actually ended up getting uh, Mario Party Super as well. Mario Super Mario, Mario Party. Party. I keep forgetting it's Super. That's how they they're calling it now. So they didn't have to put the number eleven after yeah, it. Mario Party was back in N sixty four days. This is Super Mario Party. But so, so many different titles they had. It's confusing nowadays. Mario. So that video will go up first. So we got two games today. I honestly did want to show off this real quick. Uh, I did also get Assassin's Creed. Um, this is the... Um, oh, what version was this? Not the, the Season Pass Edition. It's really, really cool. And that's Odyssey. Uh, yeah, it's Odyssey. Not confusing. I'm going gonna, gonna to show this again probably. I did actually get a few things from uh, Ubisoft, the Ubisoft store. So uh, I will actually be showing that again. I didn't get anything with Odyssey. Obviously, it's just the um, Steelbook um, limited edition with the season pass. But I did get a couple of things from uh, Ubisoft Club. So I might have that in the background um, because it's uh, everything I got from Club Ubisoft is actually Assassin's Creed related. So yep. we'll be um, doing an unboxing of that hopefully soon. I know Ubisoft Club, they, they ship pretty quick. I remember when I ordered my Division stuff, it got here pretty quick. So... Thank you all so much for being... Because you banged it, it rolled away. See what you did? You scared the poor thing. Ah, away. stay upside down. Thank you all so much for being here. We're Broken Boys. We'll see you guys soon, hopefully. Sorry we haven't done... done, 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 done I'm sorry we haven't done any videos in a while. We're going to maybe... You know, another thing we'll do on this channel is... Uh, as you all know, we like to play our Nintendo games on here. Uh, since we got Super Mario Party, we'll... Um, Pick a night, maybe, and we'll do some Super Mario Party. We do not have internet on the um, the Nintendo. Switch yet. Yeah. Um, we might <clears throat> after this video because now that we have Mario Party, there's a reason to have it. So if you guys would like to play with us, let us know in the comments below, and maybe because we only are two of us, Mike and I, so we have room for two other people. Maybe we'll invite some friends to play with us. I, you can play it online, right? I think so. I didn't check yet. I'll I haven't check. checked. Well, I'll either way, either way, there's still Mario Kart. There's still Super Smash Brothers. So uh, we'll probably oh, so Smash Bros. Ultimate. <laughs> we got a lot of people want. Right. It, so. so we're definitely getting it. We don't have it at the moment of this video recording. We don't have it. Maybe by um, week or two, we might. I don't know. It depends on if people want to play with us. Right now, it's only us. But if you guys would like to play, let us know. It's only 20 bucks. I got to give, you know, I was mad at Nintendo when they mentioned they were doing the season pass, but hey, but I got to give them props. It's only 20 bucks for a whole year. We pay 25 about, bucks every 20 three bucks. months for Xbox and PlayStation. But I thought it was more than that. I thought it was like 60 or something. 60 is a year. Oh, okay. Maybe that's why I mistaken. We don't do the year yet. When we make a little bit, when you make a little bit more money, if you want to go for the full year so we don't have to bother every three months, that's up to you. Oh, I did get the fifth, the buy one, get one free for Xbox, which was a... Uh, uh, six months, so I got a half a year. All right. No. Half a year is better. We're debating about this on an open unboxing video. Thank you all for being here. We'll see you guys soon. Be cool, stay cool, and we'll be back soon. Later, everybody. Later.